All right, uh, let's uh, now speak more about this and uh, bring in Mkauleli Maleki Kosatu's Eastern Cape Provincial uh, Secretary. Thank you so much uh, for your time and good afternoon to you. So just how concerned are you as a union just to the sentiment that employers in especially the private sector are not making deliberate efforts to, you know, prioritize South Africans and to assist in reducing unemployment rate in the country? Or are you seeing a, a different picture, perhaps? Good, good afternoon to you and the viewers. We, we, we understand what is taking place there. And I was to say, locals should be prioritized. South Africans should be prioritized in all respects. Many times, many occasions where they would um, get uh, the foreign nationals, it is because they want to pay them low wages um, so that um, they, they run away from complying with the um, uh, labor laws. That's, that's, that's the challenge. Those that are here undocumented, they, they understand to be done a favor by being employed and they would accept any conditions under which they would be working. Mm. And such poses a serious challenge. We we welcome the um, the pleads by the um, minister and then and, and the staff because it it helps us to weed out all the bad things that are happening in those in those in those areas, particularly in the in the farms where people are super exploited. And just on those blitz visits, I mean, how effective do you think they are uh, by the Employment and Labour Minister, or do you think they should be more frequent, especially when you consider that not all employers are compliant, you know, when you consider that the unemployment rate in this country has increased, you know, from the first quarter to the second quarter from 39, from 32.9% to 33.5%, essentially? I agree with the sentiments that they should not be far and few in between. Uh, I mean, the blitz. They must be a regular occurrence uh, so that at the end of the day, even those that think they would want to uh, embark on such practices, they, are not, they don't know when the minister is going to come or when not only the minister, but the minister is going to come and go. But um, those that work, the inspectors, they are the ones that should do the work. The last time I checked, the uh, Department of Labor was complaining that they've got fewer um, inspectors and uh, it is difficult for them to, to, be, to be effective in the work that they do. And we were pleading with the government that uh, there must be more uh, of those employed so that work is done. Look at, uh, at the East, in the Eastern Cape, in the Sarah Bartman area, where you have many of the farms in the province. It's where the, the, the challenge is, and um, we would appreciate that uh, though they, they do the, the compliance, but it is difficult even at times to organize those workers. But mm -hmm. we're doing our the bit that we can in terms of ensuring that beyond that's the Department of Labor, the unions that are organized there, they ensure that there's compliance in terms of everything that relates to the labor laws. All right, Mr. Maleki, thank you so much for your time. Let's leave it there for now. Mkauleli Maleki is Kosatu's Eastern Cape Provincial Secretary.